international travelers want cheap and safe Europe. Europe needs to adjust to the ever-changing international travel environment by considering the various preferences and expectations of travelers. According to the most recent travel and tourism industry data, there is primarily positive anticipation for international travel in 2024 in major long-distance markets for Europe. Nevertheless, during the first four months of the year, travelers exhibit a higher level of hesitation to visit Europe. The latest edition of the Long Haul Travel Barometer, LHTB, released by the European Travel Commission, ETC, and Eurail BV, provides insights into travel attitudes and plans for the initial four months of 2024. The research examines the willingness to visit Europe among seven foreign markets, namely Australia, Brazil, Canada, China, Japan, South Korea, and the U.S. Notable discoveries for 2024 comprise of High levels of optimism towards overseas travel in 2024 have been recorded in Brazil, 76%, Australia, 73%, Canada, 72%, and South Korea, 71%. In the U.S., intention to travel internationally remains consistent with 2023 levels, with 60% of respondents expressing a desire to do so. Japan has seen a modest 5% increase in respondents planning an overseas journey since 2023, yet intention remains relatively low at 35%. China is the only market where travel sentiment is in decline, recording a 14% decrease in long-distance travel intention. However, 64% of respondents still plan to embark on a long-haul trip in 2024. Among those eager to travel overseas in all key markets in 2024, 75% plan to visit Europe, with the remaining 25% considering other regions. According to Miguel Sanz, the president of ETC, Europe needs to adjust to the ever-changing international travel environment by considering the various preferences and expectations of travelers. He emphasized that safety and economic factors significantly influence travelers' destination choices. Despite this, Europe's attractiveness and the strong resilience of its tourism industry continue to endure. Miguel Sanz added that European tourism in 2024 will be a year of promise and challenges, as the industry navigates the resurgence of consumer demand while adopting responsible and sustainable practices. Safety, infrastructure and affordability key to selecting a destination. Safety is the top concern for travelers planning a trip to Europe this year, with 45% of respondents from all markets prioritizing a secure travel environment. The second most important factor, according to 38% of respondents, is the presence of high-quality tourism infrastructure. Destination choices are influenced by well-known attractions and reasonably priced services, which are considered important by 35% of international travelers. Canada, the U.S., and Australia are particularly notable for their emphasis on affordability. Additionally, pleasant weather conditions are a significant factor for 31% of survey participants when making travel decisions. Korean and Chinese tourists have a notable inclination towards destinations that safeguard their natural and cultural heritage. Among the respondents, 33% of Koreans and 32% of Chinese participants emphasized the significance of this aspect. This trend highlights their distinct preference for authentic destinations that uphold their originality. In 2024, 36% of individuals who opt not to travel to Europe abroad attribute the primary deterrent to high travel expenses, while 12% of respondents consider limited vacation time to be a significant factor. A mix of optimism and caution shapes travel plans in early 2024. In the period from January to April 2024, despite the increasing expenses of travel and the rising popularity of other destinations, Europe continues to attract long-distance travelers. Chinese, 50%, and Brazilians, 49%, show the strongest intent to visit Europe. In both markets, the positive sentiment is driven by younger, higher-income respondents. Australia and South Korea present moderate travel sentiment, with close to 40% considering European trips by April. Canadians and Americans express interest in traveling to Europe this year, but enthusiasm remains subdued in early 2024. Less than a third of respondents in each market, 28%,
are planning a European trip during this period. Similarly, despite the increase in travel and tension among Japanese travelers this year, the level of optimism for visiting Europe in January-April is minimal, with only 14% contemplating a trip to the region. International travelers typically intend to visit three European countries on their next trip. To cater to their packed schedules, the majority, 58%, are contemplating vacations that span one to two weeks. Australians, on the other hand, are inclined to extend their stay, as half of the participants are considering trips lasting over two weeks. The data further uncovers various preferences in daily budgets, emphasizing the importance of travel providers offering experiences that suit different types of visitors, including both lavish spenders and budget-conscious travelers. In all markets, 38% of participants are willing to exceed €200 Euros per day, with Chinese, 78%, and Brazilian, 50%, travelers being particularly inclined towards this budget range. 31% of long-haul travelers prefer a mid-range budget of 100 to 200 euros, making it the second most popular option. Australians and South Koreans particularly favor this budget range, with 40% and 42% respectively. On the other hand, only 21% of respondents are considering a daily budget below 100 euros, but among Canadian travelers, this accounts for 36%.